Okay, we got the bikes and Woozy taking care of the uniforms. Now we just gotta get an armored van and respray it with the Caligula's Casino logo. Why don't we steal one while it's on its rounds? That way we can make some money, too. Nah, I don't want to get the crew caught up in some street-level jack and it could get up. Um, I... I have an idea. Um, have you ever seen those helicopters they use to lift heavy loads? Yeah, they call them sky cranes. We could lift the whole truck and take them to someplace safe. Then we need to steal a sky crane. Unfortunately, I'm not a pilot. Well, uh, me neither. Hey, don't look at me. Or me. Shit. I fly it then. We could respray it at the airstrip. Yeah, Carl. It'll be just like fighting Berkeley, only bigger. Yeah, thanks for that. so offended that the tight end zone has no female callers that you change stations. I know I would, and have. I'm not here anymore. Opinions are free, which is why we're here. It's news and talk that our sponsors agree on. WCTR. Is the world ending? We hope so. We need the ratings. The news is next. Leanne Forger, WCTR News. News with the bottom line in mind. Top news stories. Was Moses really from Ohio? Chairs, the silent killer in your home. Now, WCTR Traffic and Transit. After months, all bridges have been reopened. Bone County, Tierra Nevada, and Las Venturas County are now linked up with the rest of the state. Locals celebrated by mass outbreaks of xenophobia and inbreeding. Also, police are celebrating the removal of a major crack cocaine ring by undercover police that has virtually stopped the flow of drugs into Los Santos. Richard spoke to a man on the scene. That's right, Leanne. It's another victory for Prohibition. Police are really celebrating after this one. One officer told me his amazing true life story of how he infiltrated this is the ring and how cool it was to get paid to get high. You should have kept your mind. Know how to bust, fool. Just a well-dressed clown, huh?
It's your choice. Personally, I want irrigation in the colonic variety. That's a whole different story. That it is, I think. Let's go to the phones. Who's on the phones? One. Come on. Call up. Anyone? It wouldn't be like this in the room, I can tell you. There I once made a phone call with 30 boys sitting on my lap. But because I paid them, they wanted to be there. Or in Mali, where nobody knows what a phone is, and a lot of people have never even heard of plastic surgery. Or the glory hole theme park. There, the glory holes aren't theme parks, I can tell you. It's violent and bloody and authentic. What are you scared of? You wimps! Give me a call! Someone! Please! Hello, you're on Wild Traveler. Where are you? I'm on a cliff. How romantic. I want to jump. I know what you mean. Jump into the unknown. How can it be a sin if it feels good? Anyway, what's your question? Why am I here? I don't know. Why are you there? Where are you? Kenya? No. I'm in Burden Club. Loathsome place. I'd jump if I were you. I want to go to hell. Me too. Buy a refrigerator magnet when you get there. On with the show. Any callers? No? Okay, maybe I should hit the travel log again. This is for my diary in Sri Lanka. For a few rupees a day, I have employed the services of a young man who has been my guide in pleasure as well as travel. There is something very exotic about him. A Trinda. He could be a boy, but like many locals, in certain lights, he looks just like a little girl. He is a real minx who knows exactly what he is doing to me. Oh, wrong page. Here we are. A Brinda took me deep into jungle. And there we took part in an ancient rite of passage for adolescents on the cusp of adulthood. We hunted each other in game very similar to the ancient games of Kiss Chase I used to play. No! Wrong page. Abrinda has left me. I broke it. I told my face. But it seems he would rather become a fisherman than follow me in an exotic life of degeneracy and narcotics as my houseboy. I hate myself. Why does this keep happening to me? Hell! Wrong bit again! Where's the page about watching the elephants mate? And it being really disturbing and making me slightly jealous for both parties. Hey! Has someone been stealing pages out of my journal? My producer is jealous. He keeps stealing my stuff and lending it to people. Last week I heard him saying government agents wanted to look at it. What a load of trash. Ah, we have a call, finally. I just want to tell people about a great holiday. You mean vacation? Call it vacation. What is it? Searching for a yeti in the Himalayas? Learning to play an alpine horn? Hunting for pythons in Africa? No, Canada. But what about a young man to peel grapes? What about fine local herbs? Hey, it's cheap and it's plentiful. Uh, apart from the rent boys. And what about the food poisoning? What about the starving beggars? What about the political instability and the chance to eat insects? I don't want foreign. Have you seen the news lately? Philistine. Well, if you want exotic, go to Hawaii. They still trade in beads there and dried planks rather than butter boats. Time for me to head south again. On the next show, we'll be discussing Amsterdam, Paradise the Game, Morocco, Stitchy Smoke. Until next time, travel safe. Ciao, Bella. I'm James Bidiston, and this has been The Wild Traveler. This is WCTR, committed to bringing you shows like The Wild Traveler, even if we received a cease and desist. The news, and all the other things that really matter to you, like people dying, lady on fire, bodies everywhere, and explosions, is hanging from the tree, this accident is really cool. WCTR. An ancient pastime just went cyber optic. Wow, look, I'm playing with myself. Exorbio. Handheld gaming action is here. The Exorbio game system fits in the palm of your hand and provides hours of fun. Oh, look, I'm playing with myself. Once you discover the action-packed action of Exorbio, you won't be able to stop. Hey, CJ, you never cease to amaze me. <laughs> Good looking. Where's Woozy? I don't know. He insisted on driving here himself. He could be anywhere. <laughs> yeah, I guess. All right, dude, I'm out of here. I'll see y'all later.
gardening show for vegetables on the radio. Gardening with Maurice. Okay, we are back in the garden. I'm Maurice, and we must answer nature's call. Going to the bones. Greetings, garden lover. What's your name? Hi, my name's Trish. Okay, is that short for Patricia? Uh, yeah. Oh, then when I asked, it's name, not nickname. Your skinhead boot-wearing friends call you at the rallies. You should do less drugs and learn to try 